Omicron in our local wastewater. It's now a reality for the city of Sacramento and Merced. Scientists confirmed the discovery yesterday and gave public health leaders the heads up. But what exactly does it mean? CBS 13's Adrian Moore is in the newsroom getting answers for us and joins us now. Adrian. Elizabeth and Tony scientists say this means we are seeing the very beginning of Omicron in the community and the impact is huge. It's a kind of early warning system that's helping public health officials respond before an outbreak. Information is power. That information now coming from a team of scientists who've been monitoring the wastewater for COVID and its variants in 10 cities across northern and central California every day for more than a year. Over the past week in Sacramento, we've seen three days where we found low concentrations of markers that are specifically associated with Omicron. Dr. Marlene Wolf is part of the research team. She says the samples taken from areas similar to these photographed in San Jose were found between November 30th and December 4th. We feel very confident at this point saying that we've seen an Omicron in the wastewater and that's the kind of information that will really help public health officials know how to target their clinical testing to confirm what we're seeing and then also to understand the impact of that in terms of the disease in the community. Local infectious disease experts call the findings significant, but warn it's still too early to know how widely Omicron is circulating or its severity. It's a call to double down on the things we know that we can do to protect ourselves. And the two main things we can do is make sure that we are fully vaccinated, getting boosters if we're eligible for those, and then wearing masks. So what are scientists focusing on now that Omicron is here? We're getting answers. Researchers say they're looking for trends, specifically where is Omicron increasing over time. While daily testing will continue in Sacramento, experts remain confident clarity is coming soon. Let's hurry up and wait, and we just we can't wait to get more data. Now, it's very important to note here, you cannot catch Omicron from wastewater. Researchers are only looking at genetic markers that show what people in the community have been infected with, so there is no risk.